This is Apple's iPad Air. It's the fifth iPad Apple has ever made and it's meant to be the world's lightest full-size tablet. Let's take a look at its key features. This is the fourth generation iPad. At 654 grams in weight, it's fairly lightweight, but it's got a thick bezel around its screen and when you compare it to the iPad mini, it looks a little bit out of date. For that reason, Apple's taken the design aesthetic of the iPad mini and then upgraded it to the Air. What this means in reality is that the Air weighs 469 grams. Once you dig inside the iPad Air, it's not massively different to the older iPad, but it does come with a few key new feature upgrades. The most important of which is its 64-bit processor. This essentially means you're gonna see a lot less slowdown in terms of frame rate when you're playing 3D graphically intensive games with the iPad Air. Although the iPad Air's camera is the same megapixel count, that's five megapixels, as the older iPad, it's got an improved sensor, which means that it should perform better, especially in low light. We've taken a few test shots to find out whether this is actually the case. In normal light, the iPad Air's photos were marginally better than the ones we took with the iPad 4, but in low light conditions, a lot of noise did show up in the Air's photo compared to the iPad 4. We'll find out if this result is repeated when we put the air through our test lab. When you slim down a tablet, there's usually less space for its battery, but Apple claims that the iPad Air still has a 10 hour battery life. That's the same amount of battery life as the last iPad and means you'll be able to watch the entirety of the Lord of the Rings trilogy in one go on the air, if you're that way inclined. There's no doubt in my mind that the iPad Air looks incredibly good. I think it's the best looking tablet I've seen all year. But the question is, with a £399 price tag, is what's inside the Air as good as its design? To find out that, we'll have to wait for our lab test results. And if those stack up, well, the iPad Air is shaping up to be one of the very best tablets on the market. For more on the iPad Air, our guide to iOS 7 and our first look at the iPhone 5S, click on the links below.